Hello guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make a delicious, delectable, like something you cannot live without. A soda slushie. Let's do this. There was just a weirdo in the background. Now he's gone because I cut the video. Now he's back. Hi! Boom, boom. Magic of a camera. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Let's get started. The first thing that you cabinet right there. The first thing that you'll need is a cup, but I need two because I'm making one for my brother and myself. Probably want to use a smaller cup, not like a large glass. So you'll also need a spoon, some ice, a resealable bag, and your favorite kind of soda. You can also do this with like water or juice, but I wanted to change this up and make it into a soda slushie because I love soda. So we're going to use our favorite sodas. Um, Hayden's using Pepsi because that's his favorite soda. I'm using vanilla Pepsi because it's not my favorite soda, but it's one of my favorites. I could also use Mountain Dew because I have a Mountain Dew in there. Mountain Dew is also one of my favorites, but I'm really hooked on vanilla Pepsi right now. So let's get started. <laughs> So you're going to need a bag full of ice and a spoon, preferably a larger one. And you're going to make this in, well, if you have a crushed ice machine, then that'll work a lot better. Just get a bag of crushed ice. But I don't have one of those, so I'm going to put the ice in the bag and hit the ice with the spoon. And it'll make crushed ice. So after, you're going to take the crushed ice and put it into your cups. And then I'll show you what to do after that. Okay? Be back once this is all crushed because it's really loud. <laughs> so I crushed up all the ice, divided them evenly into two cups, and I put the ice in the freezer for three minutes. So now I have my vanilla Coke, or my vanilla Pepsi, sorry. And I'm taking the cap, I'm taking the ice, and I'm filling it up but not all the way to the top because it will expand because it's soda, I mean duh. And we're going to quickly pop this in the freezer, so. Okay, that's in the freezer. Then we're gonna take our Pepsi and so I've got this, the bottle's too big to pour and show you at the same time. So I'm putting this on the counter. Remember, leave space and put this in the freezer as fast as you can. Sorry, I made you guys fight, but those are in the freezer. I just had to get them in really quickly. And you leave those in. It's 350 right now. You leave those in until 405. So do the math. 15 minutes, people. And I'll be back in 15 minutes to show you what happened. To pass the 15 minutes, why didn't you just have a dance party? Dance party for 15 minutes and I think they're done. Bum bum bum. Look at these. They look awesome. And to show that they're frozen. They don't fall out. So you can see though that under this it's not all the way frozen it's just frozen at the top so that's what makes it a slushy you can see here you see the the bubble moving there ah, so this is mine this is my brother's so Hayden come taste yours I'm gonna do a taste test let me get you'll need forks to like break through the top to get to the slushy and eat the ice around it and it's gonna taste so yummy let's get started So I have a fork and I'm just gonna break through the ice there. You can see I have a little 
a bit of slushy happening. So I'm going to take this. Basically just frozen that. It's good. Mm. It's cold, but it's good. This is a really good summer thing when you're like outside and it's hot. You want a cold soda? Really good. My brother's having his too. How do you like it, Hayden? Mm -hmm. My brother's mm -hmm. not tall enough to be on the camera. <laughs> oh, you're on your tippy toes though. No, I'm, no, I'm not on my toes. Mm -hmm. They can only see your gigantic forehead. You see this? And you can even like slurp the slushy like this, like. Really good. There are actually little bits of ice. Yeah, there's bits of slushy. Mine turned out better than Hayden's because you can actually see that chunk of slushy. No, I already ate all my slushy. Okay. My first thing had slushy. So, we would get to the bottom and there's like a bunch of soda left. Just eat all the slushy at the top. And then put it back in the freezer, and 15 minutes later, there will be more slushy to eat. So it's like a never ending slushy. Oh. Well, of course it ends. Never ending. Unless you eat it all. But, like, you know what I mean. Look at that chunk of slush right there. Now keep in mind that you can do this with water or you can do it with juice. You don't just have to do it with soda. I just thought soda would be cool because I love soda and I hate juice. I know, don't hate, don't hate. I'm like the only kid that hates juice. Hate orange juice, grape juice, cranberry juice, apple juice. Oh, I hate apple juice. Tomato juice, carrot juice. I hate all juice, so. Orange juice, I hate orange juice. I have a really good piece of slush right here. And there are still chunks of ice you can see. And that's what keeps it cold. <gasps> I found a really good piece of slush. So I hope you guys try this out for yourself and I hope you love this video. I love you, my Haleans. Comment down below if you'd like to be Haleans like Caitlin Cartwright calls her. Uh, her little subscribers, Lucky Charms, and I love you guys. Subscribe to Myra Green's channel and Caitlin Cartwright's channel, and I love you.